if I may. In the beginning, God laid you to rest. His intention was for you to be able to rest while he manifested your mate. While he went inside you, each of you intricately designed, he went in you and he found out what you would need for this day. And he went inside you and he pulled it out and looked beside you. Hayata. That's who it is. Trials, wrong, right, indifferent. That's who she is. There's a little girl in her. There's a grandma in her. There's a side of you that you haven't even seen, but she's there. And you've named her, good or bad, whether you've told her she's stupid, fat, or the absolute apple of your eye, you named her. She is what you've called her to be. Or maybe what you haven't had, the unction to tell her you need her to be. Marriage is a very, very vulnerable experience. And we applaud you as wives today for the responsibilities that you share. I would like for the lady to stand beside her mate. And if your mate is not here, we're going to improvise. Just begin to look at him. Not around him. At him. In your mind, visualize him. If he didn't come, just think about him. Whether he's working or if he's out selling crack, think about who he is. Features have changed, grew up a lot, been through hell. Now it's just the two of you. Remember, I do take you to be mine for richer or for poor sickness and in health, forsaken all others, I cleave unto you. And from this moment forward, as long as we both shall live, you and me. Touch his face, ladies. what he presents himself to be. What life has caused him to be. What the little boy experience caused him to be. And who he is from this day forward. Anoint his ears against the things that are said against him. Anoint his lips for the words that just won't come. Anoint his eyes. Seen too much. Been through too much. Lord. Touch his heart. Hallelujah, the seed of his emotions. That hidden part where his strength lies. Hallelujah, where the spirit of the Lord resides. Touch his hands. All that he's trying to touch, 
all that he's trying to gain, things that keeps evading him, things that he just can't seem to hold on to. Now finally, anoint his feet. The ultimate sign of submission, if you are low enough to touch his feet today, you're submitted, you've named me, I will walk with you, I will follow you, I submit to you, you are my husband. Now rise and hug him, hallelujah. Aya, hold him. Shaba, he needs you to hold him. You are him. You are him. And it's going to be all right from this day forward. If your mate is not here, just begin to wrap your arms around yourself even. Hayata. Rock him, rock her. This is enrichment. <laughs> this is enrichment. You want it to be richer? Hold on to it. Hold on to it. You want it rich? Hold on to it. Sha, rock it. Pray for it. Anoint it. Strengthen it. Breathe into it. Make it happen. Make it happen. Make it happen. It can be done. Ah, yeah. It can be done. Oh, yes, devil. We might have failed. But from this day forward, it can be done. Higher. It can be done. It can be done. From this day, this day, this is the day that the Lord has made. Our home is going to rejoice. We're going to be richer from this day forward. Give the Lord a praise right now. <laughs> Hallelujah. Shabbat. Give the Lord a praise, would you? Come on and give the Lord a praise. Come on and give the Lord a praise. Woo. I want you to do something while you're standing here. You know Submission is something that's gone out of style, and, and it's a struggle a lot of times for these modern women to enter into submission because they've seen so much abuse, and they've been so traumatized, and even 
the media and the television encourage us to, to walk in rebellion. And so it's hard. It takes the anointing to preach that kind of message and get it because you're preaching against childhood memories and scars and brokenness and fears and the humanistic sense of survival. And the only way that a woman can enter into that kind of submission is that she has an assurance that the husband is going to cover her. And so if you are here with your spouse, I want you to get behind them, men. I want you to get behind your wife and wrap your arms all the way around her. And I want it to be symbolic of the fact that you, that you are covering her. It means I've got you covered. It means I cradle you. It means I nurture you. I'm going to protect you. I'm going to be your defense. You submit, but I respect you. It means I got you surrounded. I cover you like Boaz did, Ruth. I cover you with my skirts. Ha! Congo shot. And it ain't shot. It means I won't let anything get to you. I won't let anything overwhelm you. Because you wash my feet, I cover your life. I protect you. I lay my life down. It means I'm your shield and I'm your buckler and I've got you covered. With your arms wrapped around her, I just want you to just begin to pray for her and bless her and strengthen her till she's released, until she's healed, and till the little girl in her is healed, until she's not afraid to submit, until she opens up and becomes comfortable to give you a part of herself that she's hidden, that she's hidden, that she wants to give, but she's been afraid to give. Bless her and strengthen her. Break generational curses off of her. Break bondages off of her. Break them now. 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 Break them. Break them. Cover her. She's been abused, but cover her. She's been molested, but cover her. She's come from a broken home, a broken marriage, but cover her. I got you covered. I know what happened, but I'm covering you. I know you were hurt, but I'm covering you. I know your secret, but I'm covering you. No, I cover you. Kondo shot. I cover you. I cover you. I've got you covered. I won't let anybody hurt you. I won't let anybody speak against you. I will not betray you. I cover you. Lift your hands and worship the Lord together. His presence is in this place. He's here. He's here. I dare you to worship him. I dare you to worship him. Oh, I dare you. I dare you to worship him. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you to say, as for me and my house, 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 we shall serve the Lord from this day forward, forgetting those things which are behind, forgetting them, forgetting those things, forgetting those things which are behind, reaching to those things which are before, from this day forward. Forward, devil. Forward, devil. We're going forward, devil. We're going forward. Bless God's name. Whoa. 